Okay, this plugin is called Component Stringer. So what it does is it takes a single component and applies it over a series of connected edges. The edges have to be connected and they cannot form a closed loop. So to run the plugin, you select your component and you select all the edges. Go to Plugins and it's under Chris Fulmer Tools, Component Stringer. And it shows you where the, where, it, um, where the start and end of the edges is and it asks if you want to reverse the edges. I think this is okay, so we'll say no. Then the scaling, it asks do we want uniform scaling or stretch scaling. We'll just go with uniform on this one. Click OK. And there we go, it applies that component all over all of those edges and, and it, um, went ahead and scaled them all according to the length of the edge underneath. Oh, come on. So you see here, if I delete this, there was a long edge under there. If I delete this one, it was just a shorter edge. So the scaling is dependent on the edge that it's that the component is being applied to. So we'll come over here and look at this. Okay. There we go. Okay. So I'll select this component and these edges. Do plugins, component stringer. We won't reverse the edges and we'll do uniform again. Okay, now we'll do the same thing here. We'll select the component, the edges. I won't reverse the edges, but I will do stretch and click OK. So you can see this one scaled the entire component uniformly larger to, to uh, to be the right size, to be the same size as the edge, whereas this one just stretched the component to to be the correct uh, size of of the edge. So there we have it. So we'll try that up here also with these. Okay, and component stringer. No, and uniform. There we go. So we get this nice series of these uh, balls put in put on this edge, do it again here, and then um, now with this one instead of uniform we'll do stretch and click OK. You can see what that does. It stretches, elongates these longer edges and squeezes it together for these smaller ones. Alright, so that is component stringer. I hope um, I hope it's useful. Thanks.